Hi guys, welcome back. I'm Stu, and I've got another bug video for you. But this is a this is good news. This one is um, because before I had a chance to release the bug video, they've already gone and fixed it. So I had a comment left on one of my videos. I believe it was the the one we did for the reverse free fall bug. Um, so that was by user. I believe it was Ace Aviations Two, and they said that roller coasters or with a drop of over 300 feet aren't recognized it'll show a zero so that would explain the bug that we were seeing on the reverse fall coaster so i had a play about with it and that's 311 feet drop that was fine but this one showing up a zero and i looked at the track so let's have a look at the track height on this one so this one's 340 high this one is 320 high so you've also got to account for the small drop from the straight transition into the drop and the, and the transition from the drop into the flat piece um and so what i've done is i've worked out it's around 315 feet anything higher than that and you will you will it will come back a zero but they fixed it so let's have a look at this one this one's showing a zero feet what we'll do is we'll toggle the chain left on that one Just put it back on test this one as well so the ones i've built i've already built all these because i was going to do the the video um i'll toggle this one as well to put that back into test and then this one as well so i know this one's fine that's the drop for this one is 315 so i know that was the cutoff and then we've got this one here in red so red is for bad toggle that to put it back into test so i wanted to try each type so we've got the booster the cable lift and the chain lift so the one with the cable lift 331 feet that's good one with the booster 318 feet and the one with the chain 318 feet so that bug is fixed so after that then i tried hypercoaster can't go that high Vertical drop can't go that high. So the only ones that can then, apart from the Giga Coaster, are the reverse free fall, which we've already seen. That was the first video that we did. So this one, zero feet, we'll uh, close that, delete, build, put that back into test. And the air powered coaster, so that's showing a zero feet. Let's toggle the speed on that, put that back into test. We'll run them on fast forward. And then when the stats come back, then it'll show fixed and fixed. So that's awesome news because it means that um, we've got the game playing the way it should be. And it also means that the developers are still working on the game and ironing out any bugs that we might find, um, which is really cool. So I'm, I'm really happy about that. And uh, hopefully we can start seeing some more we can start getting some more exciting coasters some more insane height coasters as well because i was hoping to build like a mega park now now that we've done with the regular scenarios do a mega park and then the coasters that i built in that would be if they were built in real life they would have some sort of world record and and one of the easiest ones probably to go for is is highest drop and when the bug was that you couldn't get over 315 foot otherwise it would result as zero that was a put a bit of a dampener on my plans i must say but now it's fixed i'm i'm quite excited about that and um yeah so i am still hope you enjoyed the video um and hopefully any more bugs that we find they will go on and fix and uh, we can play the game as it was intended i'll see you next time bye